The fuck is up? You already know what the fuck time it is. It's another episode of the Goddamn Nasty Sports Update. Today, we are sponsored, yet yeah, unsponsored by Free Weed. Because it ain't no better weed than free fucking weed. If you know what the fuck I'm talking about. Let's get into a few fucking topics. Listen. Listen. We about to run it back. Dennis Schroeder. Orange top. Just a piece. My nigga just got a little nugget. A little nugget of orange. Just to let niggas know. It's game time. We're going to change that to a little nugget of gold. Come uh, 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 Dropping dimes. Sing. Hitting threes. Bing. Defense. Where you going? Clamps. Shadow. In your hip pocket, nigga. I'm like a motherfucking beeper in 98, nigga. Fuck is wrong with these boys? Come on, Schroeder. Come on to the winning team, big fella. With arms wide open, we welcome you, my G. Welcome to the purple and gold. James gang. Bang, bang. AD. I've been hearing a lot of stories. I hear that this nigga Ron don't want to go to the Clippers. Be gone then, nigga. You want to leave? Go to the Clippers? You know what? I'm sick of this shit. I don't understand why you would like to ruffle feathers like that. Nigga, we had a good thing going. You teach young Schroeder how it's done. That's what you need to be doing, Rondo. If we could give you the same amount of money as the Clippers, why would you go there and we just want to chip? Don't let these analysts and niggas out here tell you that you ain't motherfucking in the Hall of Fame. Nigga, you is in the Hall of Fame. Fuck is they... What? Man, these niggas don't know dick. Everybody make it to the Hall of Fame in basketball. First, first and foremost, you're there, Rondo. Don't worry. Stay with us. You get you another ring with us, be just like you got a ring for the Clips. What you want to go play with them? What you want to go play with them for? A bunch of niggas that don't say shit? You a nigga that don't say much. Y'all just going to be a bunch of mutes angry. You ever seen mimes mad at each other? Niggas fighting like this. Anime. That's all it is. That's all it is. Nigga. Stay with the win- stay with the winners, man. Stay with- stick stick around with the winners. Now Atlanta trying to offer you that bag, and it's that last bag, you know, that 10, that 9, 10, 8, 10, 8 to 10 range. Go get that money, big fella. Go down there, play in Atlanta. You know, it's fun. You know, be down there with all the rappers. Big booties, all types. I get that. But don't go to the Clippers, bro. Don't do no don't do no weak shit like that. That's trash. That's trash. CP3 to the Suns. I mean, if somebody would have told me this a week ago, I would have laughed in their face. Like, why would this nigga go there? Out of all places, shit, why wouldn't he just stay in OKC? Nigga going to the Suns, play with motherfucking Play with motherfucking um, D book. That'd be a fun time for him. I I I I can tell. You know, give the young man some tutelage. But you know, shit. Niggas not going nowhere. They gotta get a big prospect. They don't got really a great pick in the draft. Them niggas gotta get a third person. So I mean, they'll be making it interesting to try to get into the Western Conference playoffs. But um, them niggas not that sweet. Uh oh wow. Oh, wow. Break, unbreaking news. Bum-ass Trevor Ariza coming to the fucking Pistons. Hey, listen, Pistons. If you want to just be bad, just say we are no longer the Pistons. We the ass stones. Or the gallbladder of the NBA. Y'all niggas is... When, listen, when you get uh, uh, gall stones, whatever the fuck that shit is, and niggas, you got to piss that big-ass rock out your dick hole... That's what the Pistons are, that rock. You pissing, and it feel like you goddamn pissing out bricks out of your dick and can't figure out how to get it out. And the Pistons is just like, we're going to be here until the times get the best. And the best of times and the worst of times, we'll still be here fucking shit up. Them and the Lions. So now you got a bigger stone. You niggas that like Detroit teams, boy. Lions, Tigers. Shit, U of M, even my Spartan dogs, Jesus Christ. It's a lot of L's being, nigga, 
L's, nigga. I'm telling you, if you was a sm- or we all, all my weed smoker shit, that's why the D got the best weed. We taking the most L's. Like, nigga, taking the most fucking L's, nigga. But CP3 to the Suns, hey, I mean, it'll be fun, you know. Them, it'll be times where them two niggas go off, you know. It's going to be fun to see uh, CP3, you know, drop some, some oops off to DeAndre Ayton and shit. But, I mean... Ninth seed, <laughs> like, them niggas just missed the offs or something. Eighth seed gets smacked around by the Lakers in the, in the first round. Cool, I guess. Um, shit, NBA draft coming up. I truly believe that uh, LaMelo might sneakily find his way to be number one. I don't know. I, it's been a lot of people saying, you know, that it's probably going to be Wiseman, but... I think the shock, the true shock value is LaMelo. And if he could come out and play like it's projected, you know, if he can continue to hit that shot, if he could continue, you know, to develop on defense more than offense, because I think he's going to be a spectacular offensive player, especially once he gets his grown man body. But if he can figure out some defense, he's a problem. That motherfucker... But Wiseman, he's a, you can tell, he's a grown man. He's a grown-ass man. And Edwards, grown man. He's, it's going to be, I, I, the Pistons, what they going to do? Now they got a reason. They got Blake Griffin. But these niggas going to get Obi fucking topping and then just have two Blakes? I mean, like, I just, I don't know. I don't know. Motherfucker seven pick. What you trying to do? Is they going to jump up? Is they going to jump up in the draft? Could they jump up and get Melo? Could they jump up and get Wiseman? Hmm. It'd be crazy. It'd be crazy, but you know what the Pistons do. Drop down and get that eagle on. Like, <laughs> shit, fuck out of here. Hey, listen. U of M, lost. Great fashion. Beautiful. The NFC East has got to be the worst division in football ever. Ever. This year, the worst division in football ever. I don't even want to talk about the Cowboys, Giants, Eagles, none of those niggas ever again. Washington Redskins. Even the Lions barely beat them bum-ass niggas. Lots of trash. Lots of niggas is getting hurt. I can't even say I hope all the niggas get better that got hurt because everybody done got fucking hurt. NCAA, stop playing, stop playing football. Stop playing football. A lot of niggas just need to stop for they never be able to play again. But this has been another episode of the greatest, the dopest, the wisest, the smartest sports commentary in under 10 minutes. We'll see you fucking next time.